What's up? <laughs> Dude, I hate that it's so zoomed in. Why can't I zoom out a little bit more? What's going on, YouTube? Swain here. Welcome back to my channel. I'm gonna be real. I wanna make vlogs. I wanna make vlogs. Why? Not for you, my non-existent fan base, but for me. Just cause it's fun to document my life, what it looks like right now. And if I get some people watching, if people watch this, fine, that's cool. If not, five years from now when I live in a completely different place, I can look back and think like, whoa, that's what you were up to every day? Today's a pretty chill day, I'm gonna be real. Um, I've wanted to do like a day in my life for maybe two weeks now, but I keep thinking, well, shit, I'm not really doing anything today. But then I thought I should probably document this. This is my life. Pretty chill right now. Um, it's chill because I'm in between jobs. Well, I'm not in between jobs because I still have a job. But literally today, I'm putting my two weeks in at the job that I've been at for five years, which is pretty significant when you're uh, 21, you know? This has been my job since I was 16. And uh, yeah, I'm leaving it. In this time, I've been a uh, kitchen employee. So I started out in this like pizza restaurant, just making pizza at 16. And I kept learning more throughout the years. If anybody in the restaurant industry is watching this, you might know what I'm talking about, how easy it is to kind of just, if you're doing a good job, there's gonna be more to obtain. And when you don't really know where you're going in life, it's like really easy to just keep accepting more of that and saying, yeah, I'm down. In the end, I decided, I don't know if I'm down just because this has been literally my only job. I, I made it all the way up to the management level and I was just like, yeah, I don't know about it. So leaving that to go to a warehouse, <laughs> a warehouse job, I'm unloading like groceries and stuff. I hope that it can be a good means to an end as well as just a good way for me to self-improve, keep getting like a variety of work experience, which is important to me, continuing to hone my skills in like communications like that's important to me. I want to be able to communicate with whoever is in front of me. Even if I clearly don't have something in common, like right off the bat, I want to be able to, to have a comfortable conversation. I'm, I'm learning how to do, which I guess in a way that this YouTube stuff can help me figure out just because I feel like I'm a little nervous. I'm a little shy. I'm a little shy guy. <laughs> so, but as I said, I'm not really doing much today. What time is it? Let's see. It's 9.40. And I work at two o'clock. So I got 11, 12, I got like three hours before I need to give a shit about work. Uh, in this time, I want to clean up, clean up my space, reset, reset my space. I had a day off yesterday, so I was being mad lazy. I played video games like most of the day, felt good. Oh, I also got this other job. Like I, I did an interview early in the morning and then I did a drug test, and then I went home and played video games all day, and it was amazing. Other than work and cleaning, I want to take care of my fish tanks. We're gonna do a fish tank video today. We're gonna to film for weekly water change number three. Pretty cool. So, yeah, now I'm just gonna, what am I gonna do? Probably do my laundry and just clean my room a little. Just gotta, Real quick though, I just got an Amazon notification that I have a package here and I'm pretty sure it just got dropped off right outside of my apartment, which is annoying because we have one of those Amazon hub things, but I don't know. Let's go find out. Henry, there he is. <laughs> Emerging from his little enclosure under the bed. He's like a gremlin. Can't forget my keys because I'll get locked out. Sit. 
sometimes he just has to try again, you know. He'll hit the spin first and then, okay. Sit. Stay. Crackhead. Go, go, go. Okay. What a beautiful day it is. There ain't no package there. Okay, I'm back from the mailbox. There was no package for me. <laughs> but there was a package for my girlfriend. She ordered some Brittany Broski merch, and it's here, along with some stickers. Well, shout out Brittany Broski. Told my girlfriend before that I don't like Brittany. So I won't pretend like I do. I'm sorry, Brittany. I just, I don't like you. I'm sorry. Now I'm gonna make my dirty ass bed in my musty ass room. Before you comment on my blue sheets, let me just say these are a gift. <laughs> and they're really nice, so. I don't care if I fit the stereotype of a boy bedroom. You gotta get yourself one of these. These bitches are nice. These I dropped a sock on the way. I have a I have a controversial laundry tip. Check this out. If you suck at folding fitted sheets, do this. This is what I do, and I don't care how wrinkly my sheets are. It's worth it. So you get the pillowcase of whatever set, and you just take everything from that set and just shove it in the pillowcase. So like that fitted sheet that's really fucking annoying to fold, just throw that bitch in there. The other pillowcase, throw that bitch in there. Top sheet. Ooh. Nice and neat. what no predators does to a motherfucker. I just got done, done filming my uh, weekly water change number three, um, where I was focusing on my mechanical timers. I'm gonna show people, I'm gonna show anybody watching how to hook these bitches up, cause uh, you know, if you're like 12 or something, maybe it's difficult. Or, hey, hey, I'm not judging. I'm not judging. That was a little rude. But, yeah, just fed the fishies. I definitely were fed on, on accident, but they'll be fine. Uh, yeah. I did call my leasing office uh, to ask about my package because we have an Amazon hub. But I called them. I was like, yo, my name's Jared. You got, a, you got any mail for me? And they were like, our Amazon hub is down currently, but I'll go check. She goes and checks, not shit. But then she just called me like five minutes ago and said that she found it in like some or unorganized mail or something like that. So we're gonna go pick it up. First, I'm gonna get dressed though because I got work in a few hours and it's just easier to already be ready. <laughs> I'm, in my, I'm in my work fit. Got my company name redacted t-shirt on, feeling good. I guess it doesn't really matter. I just live in a small town in Michigan and not many people are gonna watch this anyway. But, gotta put on my deodorant now or I will forget. Let's do it. Now you may be asking, what did you order, Jared? The reason I'm so excited, I got a carpet shampooer. Like one of those little ones, like the ones that are portable. And now I can clean my car. 
So don't grow up, kids. Don't fucking grow up because these are the things you get excited about, I suppose. Before you say anything about me being distracted, I'm literally going 10 miles an hour through a parking lot. So it's okay. Speed bump. I decided to get food because I don't have any. Sticker on this. <laughs> That's kind of funny. <laughs> yeah, as I'm waiting here, I'm also realizing now that I don't think I even have time to shampoo my car <laughs> before work. And when I get out of work, it'll be like 10 o'clock. So I'm probably just gonna do that another day. But it's still cool that we own it now. Back home. And all I got to say before I dig in is if you know, you motherfucking know. <laughs> okay, it's not really looking that presentable right now, but really good slides. Really good slides. Right, Henry? Right, Henry? Alrighty. It is now 109. So it's time to take Henry out. trying to be sly with the camera when I was recording all this so I didn't record the actual pizza coming out so here's just a few photos of some pizzas that I've done in the past that look really delicious just so you can get the general vibe snappies first got that bacon in there it looks like a hair no we're good we're good we're good yeah this is as far as I got before I got tired of eating it but yeah works pretty chill it's actually kind of busy but All right, I'm out. It's uh, 10.03, so I worked like eight hours and six minutes. Pretty solid. I like the PM shifts because I was already awake. I already got to do a good amount with my morning, and then I just went to work. I just remembered I forgot my salad, so do I want it? I think I'm just gonna not go and get it. But yeah, this was a day in my life. Um, now I'm gonna go home and play video games until like 1 a.m. Then go to bed. Did you think I was a liar? Here we are. Uh, appreciate you guys watching, if you did. If not, I appreciate myself for watching this in approximately four years minimum. It's probably when I'll give a shit.
This is the first vlog of maybe many. Just kind of depends on how I feel. Um, I'm kind of glad I was able to get a clip of me working because I've never really tried to film that. And like, say what you will, jobs are just jobs, whatever. But I, like I said, I put five years into that place. I give a shit about it. I care about its well-being. I want to see it keep growing even without me there. And I don't want to leave it messy, like, at all. Yeah. See ya.